This message is titled, If We Break One Commandment, We Break All. Romans chapter 3. Verse 23. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. First John Chapter One Starting at verse 8. If we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves, and the truth is not in us. If we confess our sins, He is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. If we say that we have not sinned, we make him a liar, and his word is not in us. There are many people who will tell you that once they come to Christ, that they are perfected. That is a lie. James chapter 2. They hinder a lot of people by saying that too. James chapter 2, verse 10. For whosoever shall keep the whole law, and yet offend in one point, he is guilty of all. Basically what that's saying, if you're trying to live for the Lord, And you mess up. It's just like you broke all Ten Commandments. Now I'm not saying. Don't try to live for the Lord. Because we must strive for perfection. We probably won't reach it. On this end. But we're to strive for perfection. A lot of people, they'll say that the two biggest sins is drinking and smoking. Not necessarily. I'm a glutton. I've never, I've never had trouble with drinking and smoking. But gluttony is just as bad. I'm no less guilty than the one who drinks and smokes. Jesus told of a parable about a man who was robbed. And he lie on the street. 
The priest and the Levite walked by. They just kept going. They, they did not stop to help him. The good Samaritan stopped to help him. You know what most people in the church would do if they seen that man laying in the street? They would pick up the phone and they'd be like, you know, I seen so and so. I don't know what kind of drug they was on, but they was messed up. They'd just gossip about them. That happens too often in the church. Christians has actually caused more problems than the sinner. If you remember, the people that Jesus had trouble with was the Pharisees. That was the religious leaders of that day. And people wonder why people don't like to come to church. That's why.